What's up guys? It's Joseph with Yard Masters Lawn Care. And tomorrow I got a few jobs. So I was wondering if y'all wanted to know how I can get ready the day before. Because a good tip is to always get ready the day before. Cause you never know if your phone might die in the middle of the night. You wake up late. Anything. So always get your stuff ready the night before. Because remember your customers ain't gonna wait on you. Now another thing. I want to show y'all some good little tips after I get it set up of how I, you know, how I put stuff in my trailer and in my car to maximize space and good ideas of what you could and should do. But yeah, enough said. Let's get into the video. See in this video that is not mine is this trailer yeah and honestly it's a little too big and it's old and if anybody know anything about old things like vehicles now they're made out of fiberglass they used to be made out of steel so what do you think this old trailer is made out of steel very heavy 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 steel like seriously whenever you're by yourself and you unload the whole trailer and then try to pick the trailer up and move it yeah it's kind of heavy but okay let's get into the video let's start with the car first I usually put all my weed eaters and stuff inside just in case it starts pouring down raining and I can't pull over in time you know to wrap stuff up but yeah currently I'm running the steel FS 56 RC and man I fell in love with this thing it's a little heavy but I fell in love with it and to be honest with you this FS 38 it's a beast it's lightweight it's com it's not commercial but it's residential but Oh my God, like it's just so powerful to be so small. And this right here is where I started the uh, the company with. This right here. I went and bought a little cheap weed eater, had a push mower. And then now <laughs> I got all these. I got my own mower. No help, my own mowers. I just went and picked that up. I don't want to spoil it, we're gonna jump into that. If you've seen the last video, you already know what it is. But yeah, so I keep my lunchbox up there. Usually I keep it in the front, but tomorrow I'm going to have somebody else rolling with me so you should see the new employee. Yeah, and this right here is my to-go-to -to box. I keep vests. You should know already. I keep vests, string, straps, zip ties, tarps. I should have put a tarp down there so I can keep my car clean, but I need to vacuum it out. Haha. <laughs> but yeah, this is my go-to box. And then I got... These right here, I suggest everybody has some of these. These right here are for your gloves. You clip it on right here, and you hook this to your belt. But yeah, other than that, perfect. I almost fell. I got me a little ladder right here in case I got to trim some hedges tomorrow, some bushes. And on the back of the trailer. Guys, I need to upgrade my blower quick. Because sometimes I go to somebody's house, and they don't have power. Because, you know, they don't live there, and they just want me to cut the grass and whatnot. And I can't blow. I can't do everything I said I was coming to do just because I can't plug up to their power. It's not their fault, honestly, it's my fault. But yeah, I gotta, I gotta upgrade seriously quick. Yeah guys, this right here is the Z335 by John Deere with a 42 inch cut and oh my God, this thing is amazing. Like, it's, it's very low. Like, if you look at commercial and residential, like this right here, I think a beginner's residential type mower. But oh my God, it is a beast fell in love with it. it has a good gas tank on it i keep a trash can at the back for my clippings for certain yards and let me get into the cream of the crop dun 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 the new toro vortex 22 inch recycler 
yes with smart stove smart stove means i can stand this thing straight up no oil leaks no nothing and then another thing about this good lawnmower is that it has no oil changes no pump no nothing you just pull it literally one time and it cranks up and then i don't know if y'all can see that little blue knob or not that little blue knob let me switch it from recycling to the bag and i need to throw the bag on there before i be done left it here and forget and whatnot but yeah this right here is my 2021 setup hopefully before next month i have me my own trailer because me and my cousin sharing this trailer sometimes i can't like sometimes me and him have to do our yards together you know what i mean and it's not a problem but i'm just saying sometimes things don't last forever and you got to invest in your business like i told y'all in the last video if you don't invest in your business it will not come off the ground but yeah this is joseph with yard masters and i hope you like my 2021 setup peace